Now, you, you, you and I must understand that marriage is not just paperwork. The culture we live in now is dysfunctional because they've decided that God is not God and that, that they are God. So they're going to make up their own thing. And that's fine if they want to be foolish. That's fine. But, but marriage, marriage is skill-based. And, and it takes more than love and it takes more than sex to remain married. There are people who have great sex that cannot stay married. In fact, if we would really be transparent, I could be very, very crass and say some of the best sex you've ever had in your life is with people you don't want to have anything to do with. <laughs> Come on, raise, raise your hands towards me. Go ahead, just do it. Go ahead, go ahead, raise your hands towards me. Say, you're loose, Pastor. See, oftentimes in the church, we don't, we're not real with people. Then they fool around and get married and come back. Now they're on my sofa. <laughs> but your pastor here at Changing Lives, Christian, said 1,800 people have made this their, their, their home. And I'm going to be honest with my members Amen. to help you to understand that marriage is for grown folks. Amen. It is not for children. Ma- marriage, marriage is not just a piece of paper. People say nowadays, well, it's just a piece of paper. and it, it, Don't marry anybody like that. Because they don't understand. Write this down. Marriage is a covenant. Amen. Marriage is a covenant. The people who are toting this mindset that marriage is just a pe- piece of paper, they're saying it because they don't want that level of commitment. Right. That's all that is. They don't want that level of commitment. Marriage is a covenant. Say a covenant. Covenant. And there are five steps that establishes blood covenant. Five steps. And I told you last Sunday that I was going to give them to you this week. Are you ready for them? Five steps. Do you want them? Five steps that establish blood covenant. Make a note. Now watch this now. When God instituted marriage. He was introducing to mankind a covenant relationship. Amen. It wasn't about just having sex. And I'm pulling on that sex thing because a lot of people in the church, they get caught up with people sexually, then decide to marry. I'm teaching already. When the sex is supposed to come after the marriage, this culture now is dysfunctional in their thinking. Through the the music is programming them. Amen. Amen. Listen to those songs. Music is powerful business. Gets into the subconscious and begins to affect your corporate thinking. The reason why many of our children are hot is because of the music. They are on fire. I don't have time to go with that right now. <laughs> all right. All right. But all the real people up in here knows Pastor's right. In fact, look at your neighbor and testify. Tell them Pastor's right about that. They are on fire. 